Okay, so I noticed from the last video after I reviewed it, uh, uh, you guys were able to some possibly see it or, or not, uh, but this one I'm unable to blow up, So, but I see that you can see it and see here. Try fitting the screen, fit page. Well, I don't want to fit. Let's go like that and see what that looks like. Pretty good. All right, so um, we'll be talking about uh, fixing and flipping uh, loans. So I'm Walter McCurry Jr. I am a referral agent uh, or uh, partner with um, Silverlink Funding. And of course, uh, Silverlink uh, offers a suite of lending solutions to acquire, develop, own, and sell single family residential and two to four multifamily units. Uh, for investment uh, purposes. And who can benefit from a silver link loan? One, the investor looking for funds to purchase, rehab, and then sell properties. Two, seasoned rental investor looking to grow their portfolio. The third is the investor who owns an investment property with equity and wishes to take out cash to purchase further investments. I have to ignore the phone. Uh, number four, the investor looking to unlock equity, consolidate debt, or purchase new rental properties. The investor looking to develop, number five, is uh, the investor looking to build or develop residential properties. Six is the investor in need of capital to facilitate a double closing. Seven is for the investor who needs a rescue loan when their conventional lenders' guidelines do not permit the financing to go through. Number eight, an entrepreneurial uh, realtor who wishes to build a portfolio. Fix and flip loans. Loan purposes, acquisition, acquisition and rehab, cash out and construction, loan amount, 50,000 to 5 million. Funding timelines, 7 to 25 days. Loan terms, 6 to 18 months interest only. Property profile, single family residential, or SFR, 2 to 4 multifamily units. Maximum leverage, 80%, that's Loan to value or LTV, 90% loan to cost or LTC, and 55% for cash out. Interest rate range between 7% to 12.5%. For the investor purchasing and rehabilitating for resale purposes. That's what that was for, or is for. I skip past that because I do have a link at the bottom of my video. So if you want to go ahead and copy it, that's fine. Again, I am Walter McCurry Jr., your referral partner with Silverlink Funding. Our bridge loans. The bridge loans here at Silverlink Funding 
Uh, this again is for the investor looking to bridge the gap between short term and permanent financing. Uh, loan purposes, acquisition, refinance, rate and term, and cash out. <clears throat> loan amount, 50000 to $5 million. Funding timelines, 24 hours to 15 days. Excuse me. <clears throat> Loan terms, 6 to 24 months interest only. Property profile, income, producing single family residential, 2 to 4 multi-family units or 5 to 20 unit apartments, warrantable and non-warrantable condos, townhomes, mixed used buildings, residential 50%, maximum leverage 75% LTV for purchase, 70% LTV for refinance, and or improvements, 55% LTV for cash out, interest rate range between 7% to Here we'll be talking about fixed loans for residential improvement property. Again, I read uh, for the this is for the investor purchasing or refinancing investment properties to hold business purposes. Fixed loans for residential investment property loan purposes. Acquisition and rehab cash out. Loan amount is fifty thousand to five million dollars. Funding timelines fifteen to thirty days. Loan terms is thirty year fixed or five to one arm. Amortized. Property profile income producing single family resident, two to four multi family units, or five to twenty unit apartments, warrantable condos. 5 to 20 unit apartments, warrantable condos, that all goes together there. Uh, townhomes, mixed used buildings, that's residential 50%. Maximum leverage, 80% LTV for purchase, 70% LTV for refinance, and 55% for uh, LTV for cash out and 55% LTV for cash out. Interest rate range between 6.770% or 6.7% to 8.95%. Okay, and uh, we have about 19 minutes left, so we'll go over some uh, Uh, more detailed uh, fix and flip uh, loans details so uh, fix and flip loans what is a fix and flip fix and flip is a short-term loan that increases here one moment so you can read it as well let's see Let's see what you can see Yeah, yeah. 
this is what I meant. Okay, all right, there you go. All right, um, fix and flip is a short-term loan that refinances the purchase of a property with the intent of improving the property rehab, uh, property or rehab, and selling for a, pro a profit. These loans are typically for 12 to 18 months with interest paid monthly, balance paid off when the property is sold. There may be two elements to the loan. One to fund the property purchase, and the second, often called a draw, to fund the modifications and or improvements in the property. Who uses it? Property investors who are in the market to improve and or develop a property and sell it, sell it use, fix, and flip loans. Often this is the full-time occupation of the borrower. Properties are usually residential properties as there is a wide and liquid market. Again, there is a wide and liquid market for these properties. Who qualifies? Lenders will focus on not only the property but the experience of the investor. Usually they will want you to see, uh, they will want to see rather a record of at least three successful fix and flips as they are partly lending against the investor's ability to turn the property at a profit. The lender will want to, <coughs> excuse me, the lender will want to know what the uh, exit strategy is to sell the property and the proposed time scales involved before making the loan. What is the borrowing base? How is it determined? Like a construction loan, there are two parts to the fix and flip loan. The first is the initial purchase of the property. The lender will typically lend up to 85% of the purchase price. The second part is the draw. The funds required to make the improvements the lend, excuse me, the lender will often finance up to 100% of the draw. Before the loan is made, an estimate of the after repair value, that's ARV, is made. The lender will limit their total loan to a percentage, typically up to 75%, if the ARV. How does the due diligence process work? The due diligence process requires as appraisal of the property, a plan for the work to be done, which is assessed and a calculation of ARV. This is long with the normal credit checks. The process is frequently fast as the data and liquidity in residential property makes assessment of value relatively easy. What is the cost? Fix and flip are like bridge loans. Rates will typically range from 9% to 15%. Interest is paid monthly or in certain rates in certain circumstances, excuse me, paid at the end of the term. There's usually points at the front end, typically two to four percent. In the event that the loan is repaid early, there may be also, excuse me, there may be also one percent or a two percent penalty. How it works? Like a bridge loan, once the terms are agreed, the lender advances the funds for the acquisition. As the project's forward and the work is done, the investor sends a request for a draw along with the required documentation. The lender will audit this and then send out the funds to the investor. 
once the project is complete and the property sold, the sale proceeds are used to pay off the loan with the balance after loan repayment being sent to the investor. Key benefits. Number one, it has a fast turnaround to the relative light paperwork required for a fix and flip loan. The loan can be turned around relatively quickly and the onus on the borrower in terms of the paperwork is low. Number two, the project is the focus of the lender. Well, the investor will need to have a reasonable credit. It is the viability of the project that will determine if the lender will advance the loan. Average credit is okay. The lender will focus more on the project and the operators. Experience, again, the lender will focus more on the project and the operator's experience than the credit and the resources of the lender. This allows for skilled operators with limited resources to obtain funding for projects. And number four is focus on strength of property market, as a lender will also review or also view the strength of a market in determining credit risk. Operators working in strong markets are able to get a loan or are able to get loans more easily and higher ARV estimates allow for better loan amounts. And uh, we'll go ahead and shut her down in two minutes or if we could uh, a little bit beyond that. So we'll, we'll shut her down in two minutes because uh, this is the equity finance and leasing so we will uh, attempt to go ahead and get that started uh, that will be by Monday of next week so this is a series that will only go on for on the days of Mondays Wednesdays and Fridays uh, Wednesday this past Wednesday is our first of the series today is the second one and uh, look forward to it uh, the times may uh, fluctuate between 5 p.m. and uh, 7 30 p.m. however just look for us to go live we always try and get it uh, posted uh, well, we'll extend that time to get it posted a lot earlier so uh, right now at 7 49 uh, thanks for watching and uh, if you attended uh, during a live uh, broadcast here otherwise uh, thanks for liking or it's a thumbs up uh, thanks for subscribing and uh, thanks for sharing. We appreciate it. As always, take care and be safe out there. And bye for now.